What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Gucci Get It Gone, man. Had to drop this one for the channel, man. Y'all, like I told y'all, I've been super busy trying to, you know what I'm saying, get myself together and, you know what I'm saying, progress and elevate in life and stuff like that, man. But I gotta keep bringing y'all this dope uh, content, man. I'ma kick it to y'all just like this, man. This is probably the nastiest track hawk in the city right now, hands down. Might be one of the hardest ones on the internet, but I ain't gonna get too cocky and go too crazy, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody riding track hawk, Mopar gang, Hellcats, all that, scat packs, all that. But this thing nasty. You see the pearl on there hitting real hard, you know what I'm saying? Then you got the 26 inch Forgiados on there. Super clean with the staggered rims ain't even got a thousand miles on them, but it ain't the outside, it's the inside. Custom interior done by Diego. If y'all know Diego, he done done a lot of people cars and stuff like that. The same dude that I used to do all of my whips did the interior on this car. It's got the panoramic sunroof, which comes with factory, nothing too crazy. You know what I'm saying? Got the track hawk stitched in the seat and all that stuff. Super clean truck. It's got the built. It's built up. It ain't all, It ain't stock. I'm going to start it up for y'all and let y'all check it out. Um, y'all got a little surprise already to see what's back there. You got two of them big speakers back there. Crossfires. Done by Midwest Sounds. Uh, check out Midwest Sounds. Real cool dude. Uh, San Fredoza. He done done, a, done some stuff for me before as well. And like I said, track hawk. Okay, Pop this trunk for y'all one time so y'all can check out the box. The box is nasty. Okay, so the lights ain't on and stuff like now, but this whole box lights up. And you see how it say Grand Cherokee Trek Hawk. It's got the 215s in there with the 40 box. Then knock the mirror down, this thing banging so hard. So nine times out of 10, I know y'all gonna wanna get a video of hearing this thing going crazy, but we can't go too hard because it be knocking down. It had knocked down the rear mirror and it broke once the first windshield. This is the second windshield. This truck has to get installed into it. Uh, but 2018 Trackhawk, super clean. This truck was for sale, sold. This truck sold in an hour. I put this truck up for sale and it was gone in an hour, y'all. Like I said, everybody loving the Mopars right now. Mopar gang is going crazy. Man, I love this truck, y'all. This definitely should have been one that I should have got, but like I said, I've been I've been doing a lot. And like I said, up here in Chicago, they've been stealing these trucks. They have been doing nothing but stealing them. And this is a rare color option because it's the pearl white. This ain't the regular white. Green belt on here, so you know it's got the pulley on there. It's got both pulleys, I believe. One or both, I'm not sure. But I know it's got an upgraded pulley. Uh, and then it's got the green belt. So you know she's making a low power. She's making about 860 to the wheels right now. So she's running real hard. So it's really about 900 to the uh, 900 total horsepower. But to the wheels, it's making 860. Pearl white, looking real good. Like I said, it got some 26 inch forges on, on there. Tell me what y'all think, man. Y'all think this one is the cleanest one y'all to see? Because I ain't gonna lie. I know this got to be one of the hardest ones out there. For sure, for sure. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of nasty track hawks in the city, but it ain't too many people just going crazy, man. You know what I'm saying? You got the interior done, then you got the crazy sound system in there, too. I mean, if you got a track hawk, man, you better watch out. But, uh, going to start it up for y'all one time. Let y'all hear that exhaust. I think the box... I think the box is turned on now. Now that I turned the truck on, so the box should be on. Oh yeah, it's lit up. There she goes. Hear that nice sound? Then you see how it's got the, the lights in there. It look way better lit up. That's why I said I had to start the truck up for y'all. So that y'all can hear the uh, exhaust. Check out the lights. And then you know I'm going to turn that bass on so y'all can hear that bass. I was supposed to do that manually. I just tweaked and closed it, but it ain't gonna stop nothing. But uh, anyways, turn something on for y'all so y'all can hear something. <laughs>
show y'all the music, man. It, it go crazy. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Then, you know, with the panoramic roof in there. Whew. Man. I ain't gonna lie. Shorty jumping here. I ain't got no choice but. <laughs> yeah, this it, y'all. I ain't even gonna lie to y'all, man. Too bad this thing I already sold, bro. Because if I would have seen this truck in person before I sold it, I would have had to buy it. But like I said, I got a lot of little stuff going on, y'all. I got some big, 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 big stuff on the way for y'all. A lot, a lot of dope stuff on the way, man. Like I said, we just got the play playhouse for the cars. That should be uh, dropping next month. I just got to get situated in there. I want to get a little stuff, you know what I'm saying, put together. So when I do uh, do what I do, y'all, it's going to be all the way together. This thing ain't got no gas in it, so let me turn it off. Uh, but like I said, let me know what y'all think about the track hog, man. One of the hardest track hogs that y'all probably have ever seen. Uh, like I said, she's super nasty with these trucks, not any trucks. I'm going to just put it to you like this. Like me, my style be more of the stock with a twist. You know what I'm saying? So that's why, like I said, this is one of my buddies. You know what I'm saying? I helped them do a little stuff with the truck and stuff like that. And like I said, he, he definitely snapped, you know what I'm saying? Got him the wheels and stuff like that. Anybody that need Forgiatos, make sure y'all hit me up. Number one selling Forgiato dealer in the Midwest area besides my one of my homies, you know what I'm saying? But Chicago land area, sold up, man. Ain't nobody messing with me when it comes to selling these Forgies, man. Pretty much everybody that got their Forgies out here, most of them got them from me, you know what I'm saying? Big shout out to Extreme too. They doing their thing too, but I'm telling you, I'm worldwide with this, bro. I sell them everywhere, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, nasty, nasty track hog, y'all. You know what I'm saying? And I ain't gonna lie. This thing is clean. And I like that pearl, because when you see that, like the, I know y'all can't see it in the video that good, but man, in person, that pearl hit. Like it really, really hit. And then like I say, it got the sounds in there. It's got the 26s on there. It's built, it's running, like legit. It's all the way there, y'all. I love this truck. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. But like I say, she sold, man. She off to the new owner. We got her over here at the spot. You know what I'm saying? We always go to. Uh, got her cleaned up and stuff like that. So when you take his baby home, she already ready to go. And like I said, make sure y'all like, share, subscribe. Tell me what y'all think about the track hog, man. Like I said, I'm really, really feeling the track hog. You know what I'm saying? Big boy Dooley over there. Y'all see that thing, man. We're gonna get some updates on that thing, man. We done added a couple updates on the on the workhorse. So I'm gonna drop that. And I got another surprise, y'all, for that too, on the workhorse. So make sure y'all tap in on the 2021 3500, man. But like I said, make sure y'all like, share, subscribe, comment, let me know what y'all think. And then also, definitely want to tell y'all again i appreciate everybody that's been tapping into the channel and showing the support man definitely been loving it man but hold on let me show y'all a little something show y'all a little surprise man a little something something man put them lights on let me see them lights up there man got to show the channel what we got going man before somebody try to bite and try to copy what we got going man look at that <laughs> how y'all coming though uh-huh this that 2021 look with the stars in the headliner. Yeah, y'all see them, they turn all different colors. Yeah, sir. Yeah, fucked them up with that one. Then remember that. Longhorn. This that big boy. Yes, sir. Look at that. All different type of little prints and stuff in there. This that big boy. Mega cab. Let y'all take another look at the track hog before I cut the lick off. But yeah, she gone, y'all. Track hog sold in an hour. You know what I'm saying? The crazy thing is with these track hogs right now that a lot of people don't know is the production has stopped on all the cars because of the COVID. So dealers don't even have cars right now. So the market on these trucks is super high right now. And honestly, for the price that I gave this truck away for, man, it was a lick. You know what I'm saying? But it's all good, I man. Let the let next man ride it because, like I said, up here in Chicago, you can't even enjoy these trucks because everybody's stealing them and stuff like that. You gotta put anti-theft tracker devices and 
GPS stuff on your truck just so that, and then you drive them, you go, can't kick it inside the bar because you stay in the bar, they're gonna steal your car and all kinds of stuff. They've been shooting people for these trucks. It's just crazy, man, with these track hawks up in Chicago. Like, it's better to just stay away from them. You know what I'm saying? And that's really been my main thing on why I haven't really jumped out the box because everybody been, it's, 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 it's pretty much, it's a, uh, it's a, uh, negative it's, it's more negative things to these cars than it is positive you know what i'm saying they're very beautiful trucks everybody loves them but it's just too much negative like you got to worry about somebody stealing you stealing your car or trying to rob you or anything like that it's not worth it you know what i'm saying but this is definitely the one right here y'all and bro that bought this truck man he gonna be super happy i know he happy uh as soon as he come down here and pick it up he gonna be sold he been calling me every day for this truck you know what i'm saying every single day so he gonna be able to pick up his baby right now so i'm gonna go and cut this video off we finna go handle our situation that we got going on and i definitely appreciate y'all and make sure y'all like share and subscribe to the video and drop in the comment section and tell me what y'all think but the track hog sold one hour you know what i'm saying it ain't too many people selling car trucks like this in one hour. And like I say, everybody complains on pricing. Never complain about the pricing, man. It's either you got it or you don't. There's nothing wrong with not having it. There's no, you know what I'm saying? You got to work your way up. Nobody had, everybody that got it didn't have it at some point. They had to work their way up to get that. And like I said, I'll be trying to motivate everybody to be more positive And you know what I'm saying? learn how to move as bosses you know what i'm saying and, and networking with people is the best thing that you can do you know what i'm saying instead of like negative stuff and like people like oh this dude doing what i'm doing and this dude doing what i'm doing no if y'all all network together it looks better you know what i'm saying it's better for people to move as a whole than one person you know what i'm saying and there's just some little game that i wanted to drop on y'all because like i said i'm i'm very appreciative of what y'all been helping me you know what i'm saying like i said with the videos and stuff like that and like i said i know it's a lot of people watching and i like i said i just like to give people motivational stuff you know what i'm saying stuff that y'all can use to better y'all self you know what i'm saying like i said when you ain't ready to do something man your time gonna come man just wait for it and be patient like i said it was a time where i didn't even have no car you know what i'm saying people used to talk down to me like man gucci you ain't got no car and this and this and this eventually i got me a car then the next thing they're gonna say you ain't got rims or whatever. People always gonna critique you. You know what I'm saying? They gonna always try to talk about you or bash you, whether you're doing good or bad. Just focus on what you got going and don't let none of that hate or negativity bother you. Just move forward and, and stay positive. You know what I'm saying? Anything, any of this stuff y'all see on the channel, y'all y'all are able to get this. All you gotta do is put your mind to it and work for it. You gotta grind. That's all it takes is grinding and, and staying positive and you gonna always get what you want. So. Like I said, I definitely appreciate y'all once again, man. And make sure y'all like, share, and subscribe. Make sure y'all check out my Instagram at Gucci Get It Gone. And it's all love, y'all. And I'm gone.